Nigeria may be contending with issues of moral uprightness in all facets of the society, but success can still be attained through hard work and high ethical standards. Now, this was the message the young Nigerians, particularly the girl child, at the presentation of a book, Winning Without Compromise, which was launched in Abuja. Victoria Anna is a young and intellectually gifted author who expressed her thoughts on issues of great national importance through writing. The author of three books is challenging the moral uprightness of women by assuring them that they can still attain success in life through hard work without compromising their dignity and integrity. Um, so this book is a passion project of mine that I have done for young girls globally to let them know that even though we live in a generation where there's so much sellouts, there's a lot of compromise, people do all kinds of uh, untoward stuff just to gain some level of success. I want them to know that they can win, they can thrive, they can take up space without devaluing themselves morally, spiritually, you know, doing things that are not in sync with what they represent, their virtues, their principles. I don't want girls to be so concerned about success, the rush, you know, to want to succeed, to want to achieve things. I want them to be grounded. I want them to stay true to their values, their principles, and go about things the right way. Invited guests for accolades on the writer, with many of them saying that the book be institutionalized due to its messages of hope for young Nigerian girls. This material is a must read for every young girl that wants to grow to make a big difference in this country. Um, I personally will want to recommend that this book becomes an institutional book. Um, school systems, school system leaders, um, educational instructors, members of National Assembly who represent different constituency should see this book as a tool that they can use to reach out to young girls in the communities, you know, like never before. So the society that we are right now, a lot of people are doing the wrong things to get the right things. And that is where, and that is a major problem. That's why you see people are becoming selfish, greedy, envious. And when you look at the sum of everything, you know that these feelings trigger people to steal to lie, to, you know, um, compromise on to compromise on their morals. But with this book, it just teaches us that you can still be a winner, you can still get your life going on without compromising. I found her very dedicated and passionate. So when she wrote the book, I mean, we've had to also debate the title, especially in a country like Nigeria, where you say, uh, is it possible to win without compromising? Uh, and she's, you know, laid out examples using her own life as, a, you know, as a, as a compass. It's a good move, of course. Uh, see more women playing their role uh, beyond just the stereotypical things that I think women are. But we're all here because of a woman, and that is fantastic in itself. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.